girl, so pretty. Hi, today I'm going to show you um, how I groom my standard poodle. Uh, poodles can be groomed in many, many ways. And this is one style that I do for the spring or summertime. She has had many clips, but I thought I would show you this one as it's a little bit different than, than normal. Alright, so she's already been bathed and dried and combed out and she's ready for a haircut. You ready to get started? Alright, so for her front legs, I'm going to be uh, clipping her legs down and leaving a palm on the bottom. I'm just doing basically a modified a continental clip. Now she's just a pet poodle, not a show dog. And um, so I just want to make her look nice and fancy for the summer. So what I do is I start to clip. Let me just raise the camera. I'm gonna leave. I'm gonna be leaving a, a jacket on her. So what I do is I feel where her muscle is here when it comes down and it meets her leg. I like to start um, just where that ends. If you feel muscle comes down and in, I like to start right about here and where I clip. And I'm using a 5F blade. And I'm using my cordless wall KM cordless wall clippers and I love these. These are hard to find and I love mine so much. So it's a 5F. You can go shorter if you want, like a 7F. So I'm not going to go too far down. I'm going to fix that up later. armpit so I'm gonna be leaving a jacket um, but I like to make it a little bit different on top than what other people do but uh, generally you find where the last rib is if I can find it on you girl gotta go jogging now, somewhere right around here you don't want to come too far up I mean you can if you want but in generally you usually go where the last rib is but on the top, I'm going to leave it more in a, um, like a V-shape on top. So I'm just going to start right here and work my way down. I always leave it longer and I can always fix that later. And I'm just going to go down her thigh. So I have to match up the two like palms on each leg, on each side, like the front and the back. You want them even, you don't want like one higher than the other. Get rid of all that hair. So I'm just gonna go. You see I come where the curve of the leg is and it gets like thinner right here. Just where it starts to bend. Right about there. And I have to do the inside of the leg as well. So for the top part, like instead of just going like straight across to leave a jacket, now this is a bad angle for me. I'm just going to leave, I want to cut this off. I'm going to leave just like a V back here. I can show you later as well. I don't know, I just like to do it sort of like that.
Kind of go right underneath. Try to make this line straight, but I do that at the very end anyways. I make sure that this one is even with the other side. I just feel the bone and where it goes in. I feel the leg. side. Hopefully they're even. Even. Lift up, baby. I'm just going to go under her belly. I did her groin. But I'm just going in the middle here because, uh, you know, I don't want to deal with matting and everything. I'm just going to clean up the lines. I'll put the rest with scissors. So when you're making, you know, lines and you want to find a pattern, you can use your comb and just draw a line and see what it's going to look like. So I think I'm just going to angle, I'm going to angle it to here. Just because I like it, that's all. <laughs> I like it. Get rid of that and then you just make like a curved line here. And this has to grow out because it's really short. But there, and I'm going to straighten up my lines. Actually, I am going to take this off right here. I think it will look better. Because I'm leaving that little V up here, so I'm just going to go straight along. There we go. Look nicer. Alright, so I got my V at the top and what I do is I comb it out like this. Just so that I can trim along the line and once it grows out I can trim it even better. She doesn't have a lot of hair so I don't have a lot of scissoring. Scissoring. Just 
going to tidy up underneath here. Just along this line here. Once it grows out, it'll look better. I'm just going to clean up her little poofs here. Looks like I messed up a spot right in front just because of my angles and the camera's in my way, but it'll grow. <laughs> Hopefully you can see this. Yeah. So what I do is I just trim along the cuffs there. She doesn't have much coat there because she was short last time. Just do around the cuffs and I'm going to let these grow out. So you can have big poofs, right? And then what I do is I kind of just I comb it upwards. And just trim around the top there. More like cylinders. This is what they look like. Yeah, I'm just evening them up. I'm going to let them grow out and Probably let them get pretty big. But I'm just just tidying them up right now. In the bag, this has to grow here. It's really short here because she was one length, but this has just grown longer. So it doesn't look like you know properly shaped right now. Good enough, good enough, huh? Actually, I'm not even gonna cut this here because I want this to grow. I want this to grow fluffier, I think. This needs growing way back here, obviously. Wait, let's just have a look and see. Yeah, I'll trim a little bit. A little bit. Just fixing up the back of her front leg. I just want that to go a little, little bit higher, right there. There, so this has to grow so I can get it in proper shape. Pretty girl? Who's a pretty girl? So there you have it. I'm not going to trim her top knot or her tail. Anyways, I hope you like this. You like it. It's just something different, but the pom palms have to grow out, obviously. And I have to trim her tail and trim her top knot. But anyways, I just like this fancy little 
area here with the V and it comes down on an angle so you know you got the V in the back and then it comes down on a, a V again so we can call this the V clip <laughs> there you go I just made up my own name the V clip it'll look nice too once the rest of the hair grows out and this will be like fuller and then you can blend this more rounded and her chest she doesn't have very much chest hair when the chest hair grows out it looks really nice right you happy you gotta go pee pee gotta go pee pee okay make sure you check out all the links down below in the description there's a poodle playlist if you'd like to see more clipping and um, thanks for watching that's my bird <laughs> and I will see you in the next video